good morning to uh, dear students today i am going to tell about the last topic of ignition system that is the third type electronic ignition system already we studied about the battery ignition system and uh, magneto ignition system so as compared to those two this is not that much of not important but as per your syllabus we have to study this also okay but uh, uh, magneto ignition system and battery ignition systems are very very important for the point, uh, point of examination okay so in this chapter i will tell you about the working of electronic ignition system so uh, see this is a complete uh, circuit diagram of electronic ignition system so in previous case in battery ignition system what we are getting power from what we are getting power is from uh, battery so in magneto power is getting from magnet so here with the help of some circuit that is electronics with the help of the battery also we are getting here power also here power so normally it consists of i will tell the main uh, construction parts so first it will con consist of battery so normally batteries uh, having two terminology one is negative one is positive negative is connected to ground uh, that is called as earthing positive is connected to the ignition switch that is connected to the electronic control module so the main function of electronic control module is it will give the signal to the uh, ignition coil how much amount of voltage is required that is the main function so ignition coil in the ignition coil like it consists of two parts primary winding secondary winding so in here a new part uh, has connected uh, called as armature or relocator okay so in above battery ignition system and magnetic ignition system we are using capacitor or the condenser in place of capacitor condenser in electronic ignition system we are using a armature it consists of one end is that is vacuum so here one small part is there near to that so that is called as a magnet magneto pickup point okay so distributor uh, so as we already each distributor is connected to spark plug to ignite the spark so that spark is connected to the engine vehicle to move the vehicle if the combustion takes place means okay so this is about the construction part now i will tell you about how it will work so normally the battery will supply to the power that is around a small amount of power that is 10 to 15 volt that will supply to the electronic control module so this electronic control module it is shortly called as ecm so ecm is connected to armature so due to from the ecm mode small amount of power is transferred to this that is armature as well as ignition coil okay so the main function of this armature is to break up the uh, primary current which will coming from the ecm mode so this here center is as this armature is rotated at this point it will contact here it will it will send the signal to this will stop the uh, current okay so due to this the current coming from ecm mode is will stop to this side and the only current is passing through the ignition coil okay so in ignition coil again there are two types due to this sending to this in primary winding a small amount of current will be present due to this a small a very high amount of magnetic field is generated in the uh, secondary winding uh, secondary winding okay coil so that second that is large amounts from uh, around uh, Mm, th up to mm, 20,000 to 25,000 volt can generate so here in from the secondary uh, winding coil the power is transferred to distributor okay now in distributor again the each cylinder consists uh, each cylinder connected with a spark plug so the high power is transferred to the each spark plug and due to this uh, here is due to some ionization between this uh, metal piece and the spark a uh, ignition will take place that is combustion takes place due to combustion a power is obtained due to that power the vehicle is moves so this is about the working of electronic ignition system so i will repeat this working once again please listen carefully from the battery small amount of current is passed to the ecm mode so based on this ignition switch are on so from ecm mode small amount of power is transferred to armature as well as uh, ignition coil so after some time the flow of current from armature is will be stopped and here primary winding small amount of current will be transferred continuously and uh, after once it is stopped a uh, sum of very high emf will be generated in the secondary coil due to that that emf a large amount of uh, volt is generated that volt is transferred to distributor distributor is connected to each spark plug this high amount of voltage is transferred to um, spark plug due to some ionization between a metal piece and this is spark plug a spark ignition takes place it is combustion takes place due to this a power is generated to run the vehicle so this is about the working of electronic ignition system so the main advantage this i wrote here same working of uh, electronic ignition system in six sentence so main advantage main this uh, uh, electronics 
ignition system are used nowadays almost all the vehicle that is mahindra xuv 500 uh, and audi a4 mahindra okay na and uh, some uh, sports car also they are using and it is also used in the aircraft engine due to its better reliability and less maintenance as compared to those two so i hope this is about uh, the uh, electronic ignition system working and circuit diagram i hope you understand this uh, thank you